now let's see what's meant by plain polarized light and partially polarized light okay so we know that uh, we have seen this thing earlier so light from the source comes here it's unpolarized and uh, from the polarized it's made to vibrate only in one direction okay then with the help of analyzer we check and see whether light is polarized or not by rotating it okay if it's horizontal means light ray will be blocked and then we'll get dark color here suppose this is also vertical and this also vertical means we can light will pass through we can see the light okay now what we doing we're checking it okay so polarizer now what does it do it makes the entire light rays to vibrate only in one direction so we are making it fully plane polarized okay let's see what happens in that time we'll draw a graph here okay we'll draw a graph between intensity and the angle so what we're doing is we are rotating the analyzer okay we rotate by 0 the 90 180 273 60 like we will rotate it so 0 degrees here okay the 90 180 degrees 270 then 360 okay. and then on this uh, y-axis we have the intensity of light okay. the intensity here you have the maximum value and here you have zero okay. now what we do is so this is zero here okay. as you rotate the analyzer okay. as you rotate the analyzer what happens is the intensity of light will change first it will be maximum okay if both are vertical if this is vertical and this is also vertical means first we will be getting maximum here Okay, I'll draw it and show it to you. So in this case, first case, what happens is both are vertical. So light will pass through. We'll get the maximum amount of light. Okay, so we'll get the maximum amount of light here. Then after you rotate by 90 degrees, okay, this uh, thing after you rotate by 90 degrees, it will come as first it was like sway. Now it will become horizontal. So when it becomes horizontal, no light will pass through light will not pass through so the intensity will drop to zero okay. then again you rotate it again it will become vertical so light ray intensity will again increase the brightness intensity means brightness it increases then again when you rotate it okay, the intensity will decrease here okay, to zero then again it will increase so you can see that the intensity will change from maximum value to zero value then we can say the light ray is fully polarized or plain polarized we say <coughs> next what we do is in case the polarization is not effective, it's not fully polarizing the light. Okay. Let's see what will happen. Okay. So again, we'll draw the curve here. Graph here, 0 degrees. Okay. This is 90 degrees. 180. Then 270. Then 360. Okay. Now, this is the intensity again. The same kind of graph here. Intensity. The intensity value changes from a maximum value. Now, it's not becoming 0. Okay. It becomes to a value of minimum value. That means the light is coming out. It's not fully polarized. Okay, there is some unpolarized light also like this way. So it's not fully polarized here. So let's see what happens in this case here. So as you rotate it, the value of the light will change from maximum to the minimum value. It will not exactly become zero. Okay, so it will reach to a minimum value only. Okay, it cannot become zero. Then at nine degrees it will become minimum value. Then again at one eight degrees it will become maximum because it will be vertical. Then again it will decrease at 270, then again it will increase at 360, but it doesn't become zero. Okay. That time we say the light ray is partially polarized because it will again it will contain some uh, components which are not fully polarized here. Okay. So plain polarized means uh, the entire light is fully polarized. In partial polarized light means the light ray will not be completely polarized. Okay. So intensity will change as you rotate the analyzer. So this is about plain polarized light and partially polarized light. Thank you for watching.